What's the situation with that freighter out of the ice uh, off of Conneaut? Well, right now the Coast Guard cutter Bristol Bay has been trying for several days to break through the ice into Ashtabula Harbor. They're finding that it's too thick for, for their capacity. So they're going to meet up with the Canadian Coast Guard ship Griffin, uh, come back to Cleveland for to get some more fuel, and then the Canadian Coast Guard ship Griffin will return and see if they can get into Kania. They have uh, It's a bigger ship, so they have more capabilities. If they can't, they're going to work with the master of the uh, Arthur M. Anderson to, to see what their other options are. And while they can't get into the port because of uh, 8 to 10 feet of ice in the port, they're not, they're not stuck in the lake. They could actually turn around and go home if they had to. Right. The, the Arthur Anderson is not, they're not stuck. They just can't get to where they want to go. So, so they're looking at other options. What's the hardest part about all of this? That I really don't know where we are in the process, and I really don't know where to turn. What happened when you showed up for your son's orthodontist appointment? Uh, there was just a note on the door saying they were closed from the 3rd to the 11th. It was the 12th. I double-checked the date, and nobody showed up. And you already paid your money? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That's been long paid. What's the most frustrating part? The most frustrating part is that it's going to be very expensive to continue this endeavor when it's already been paid for. And no answers? No. No reason why they closed? Correct. Correct. Thanks. Thank you.